Welcome back to Passionate About Tech. With Windows 10 support ending on October 15, 2025, are you stressed about losing critical security updates for your PC? Don't worry. Today, I'm diving deep into how to upgrade your Windows 10 Home or Pro to the Long-Term Servicing Channel, or LTSC, without losing a single file or app. This will keep your system secure with updates until 2027 or even 2032 for IoT LTSC. Let's start by checking your Windows language to ensure compatibility with the LTSC ISO. Press the Windows key, type CMD, then right-click on it and select Run as Administrator. In Command Prompt, type DISM, space, slash, online, space, slash, get, dash, intel, and press enter. Look for the default system UI language, like English United States. Write this down, as your LTSC ISO must match this language to avoid installation issues. For example, if your system uses English United Kingdom, you'll need that specific ISO version. Next, let's download the Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC ISO. Open your preferred browser, and search for Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC Archive and hit Enter. Click the first link that appears to visit the ISO download page. Scroll down to the Download Options section, find the ISO image option, and click to start the download. This method uses archive.org, a trusted source for older Microsoft ISOs, as LTSC ISOs aren't freely available on Microsoft's website without a volume licensing or Visual Studio subscription. Ensure you download the correct language version to match your system. Now, we need to trick Windows into thinking LTSC is already installed to allow an in-place upgrade that keeps your files and apps. Press the Windows key plus R, type regedit, and hit Enter. In Registry Editor, expand HKE Local Machine by clicking its arrow. Scroll down and click Software to open it. Find Microsoft in the list and click to expand it. Scroll to Windows NT, expand it, then click Current Version to select it. On the right-hand pane, you'll see several entries we need to modify to make Windows think we're already running LTSC. Find Composition Edition ID, double-click it, and change the value to Enterprise S with a capital E and capital S. Click OK. Next, find current build, double-click it, and change the number to 19044, then click OK. Below it, find current build number, double-click, and set it to 19044 as well. Click OK. Find display version, double-click, and change it from something like 22H2 to 21H2, as LTSC 2021 is based on this version. Click OK. Find Edition ID, double-click, and change it from Professional or Home to Enterprise S, with a capital S. This is critical, as incorrect capitalization will break the upgrade. Click OK. Find Product Name, double-click, and set it to Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC 2021, matching the exact spacing and capitalization. Click OK. Finally, find Release ID, double-click, and set it to 21H2, replacing any other value like 2009. Click OK. Pause the video here if you need to double-check these entries on your screen, as accuracy is crucial to avoid errors. Close Registry Editor immediately without restarting your PC, as a reboot could interfere with these changes. Now, let's start the upgrade. Locate the LTSC ISO, and double-click to mount it as a virtual drive. Once mounted, double-click setup.exe. In the Setup window, click Change how Windows Setup downloads updates, then select Not right now to speed up the process. Click Accept to agree to the license terms. When you see the option to change what to keep, select Keep Personal Files and Apps, then click Next. Click Install to begin the upgrade. 
This process can take 20 to 40 minutes, depending on your PC's speed, and your computer will restart multiple times. Don't panic if it seems stuck, especially during the getting ready phase this can take a while as the installer adjusts to the modified registry. Just let it run. Once the upgrade completes, verify it worked. Press the Windows key, type Settings, and hit Enter. Go to System, then click About at the bottom. You should see Windows 10 Enterprise LTSC, version 21H2. Check that your files, apps, and desktop shortcuts are still there. Open a few, like Chrome or Steam, to confirm they work. To activate Windows, you'll need a valid LTSC license which you can get affordably from premiumcdkeys.com. Open your browser, type premiumcdkeys.com in the address bar, and hit Enter. On the official website, type Windows 10 Enterprise in the search bar. Select the Windows 10 Enterprise 2021 LTSC option, choose the Global License option, and click Add to Cart. At checkout, Enter the discount code TECH9 to save on your purchase, then click Proceed to Payment to complete the transaction. Once you have your license key, go to Settings. Click Activation. Select Change Product Key. Type your key, then click Next. If you don't have a license yet, you may see an unactivated watermark until you activate Windows with a valid key. Next, ensure your system is up to date. Press the Windows key, type Windows Update, hit Enter, click Check for Updates or Install Now to get the latest security patches and drivers. And that's it. If this guide helped extend the life of your Windows 10 PC, hit Subscribe to join the passionate About Tech community for more in-depth tech tutorials. Got questions or ran into issues? Drop a comment below, I'll do my best to help. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.